What's up, everybody? OMB. Hey, look, I appreciate y'all subscribing to the channel. Do subscribe if you're not subscribed and hit that bell icon so you can be notified of future videos. Okay. Brandon Moreno versus Davison Figueredo. Moreno versus Aredo. <laughs> hey, that's so. But yo. Okay. I knew I seen them guys before. I'm like, why do they they look so they look they look like I seen them down the street somewhere, you know what I'm saying? Because I seen them so many damn times. I seen them at least two times. This third time I done seen them. But so I'm like, that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Moreno, he did his thing. You know what I'm saying? He was he was he was getting the better of Figueredo. And he was just faster. He was more on point. You know what I'm saying? But there was something that I had. To, every time they showed the replay, I was like, oh. All right. Moreno had caught Figueredo with, I believe it was a left, a left shot. And it appeared to be a thumb in the eye. Now, from what I understood from the commentators is that it was the side of the thumb, so it counts. It don't count as as a um as an as as a, as illegal, but it counts as a legal shot. Now, maybe it was just my imagination. Because I wasn't on my TV I, I was on my monitor I was using my phone But it looked like Moreno had his thumb out When he took it And he took that swing I'm just saying y'all If I could see a replay of it again I surely would love to see it again Which I probably will see it You know so It just looked like that But When, it, when they did a closer look You can see the side the side just boom but when you look at Figueredo's eye from being in boxing I mean not being in but from watching boxing so long that looked like a thumb in y'all but even the side of the thumb you know it's still you know even that that's enough to you ain't poking it in but you know that that yeah, man. If you put a hard swing on that, that can push that eyeball in. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and rattle that retina back there. But I just seen one of these critters around here crawling. If it's a big ass raccoon, I got a pistol for your ass. Y'all kind of, y'all get aggressive when y'all got little ones around. But anyway, um, you know what I'm saying? Um, you know, so it it, it was this is the fall fight they had. If, if I'm correct, you know what I'm saying? If it's the four fight and Moreno, he left he left with the belt. But I'm gonna tell y'all what I didn't like. I didn't like the fact that y'all threw drinks and food at Moreno when he was leaving. That causes for people not wanting to have fights in Brazil. That's what that stuff causes. When y'all do stuff like that, nobody's going to want to fight there. Nobody's going to want to come to Brazil and fight there if your fans are going to be doing stuff like that. That's a sore, y'all sore losers. Y'all booed the man all the way through everything he said. Why? Because he was from Mexico. See, y'all got to get out of that, man. Y'all got to get out of that, B. Yeah, that is some stupid stuff that was implanted in your mind by some idiots who wanted to keep that little divide going y'all gotta get out of that and stop being sore damn losers you know what i'm saying so you know moreno won the fight you know uh i, I mean he did he, yeah i can't really say much about it he was beating figueredo to punches kicks and everything man i mean figueredo he he just didn't he just didn't he just didn't have it man you know what i'm saying he just wasn't there you know he was he was absent. He was there, but, you know, he just... It wasn't the same fight that it was before. You know what I'm saying? So it seems like Moreno did his homework and Figueredo figured he can stick with what he stuck with. 
last fight. Well, that's my thoughts on that one. I got one more to talk about. OMB signing out. Peace.